Hey there folks, I am Chris from iLather.com and today we're going to bring you a top list. And today's list is my top 15 lime scented uh, soaps or creams. Now the rule for this video is the predominant note um, has to be lime or lemon. We'll, we'll just call it lemon lime um, because sometimes it's lemon and not lime but I'm just going to throw them both in here as lime for the purposes of this uh, video, for the purpose of this video I should say. We're going to start off with two soaps that are sadly no longer made and there's <laughs> Lexi running around back there already. Tim Soap Busta's Blend. This was a soap that was made to honor the great Busta and it's got a really nice lemon lime-ish scent and there's some other stuff in here too, a, a bit of spiciness to it. Um, so if you happen to see this for sale somewhere, which would be rare, uh, I would pick it up because it's a really good lime scent. If I had to pick one that was my all-time favorite lime scent. It's Tim's Old School Lime. This is just fantastic, straight-up lime, like a punch in the face <laughs> of lime, which I love. It is absolutely beautiful, and it is so sad that this, that this is uh, long, no longer made. So if you happen to see this somewhere, I would definitely pick it up. Tim's Old School Lime. And next we have So Commander Respect, which is lime and patchouli. Really nice lime scent. You really get that lime burst and then a little bit of spiciness to it. Very good quality soap. Very good quality people. Um, soap Commander Respect. Next up we have Soap Commander Lime Soda. And this smells like its name. It smells like lime soda. Which is just really nice, fresh. I wish I could smell a little bit better right now. I'm under the weather. But I love uh, this lime uh, scent and in fact I love the aftershave too. This is really nice stuff. I'm gonna use this again soon Next up we have Maggard soaps. This is limes and bergamot. Some people call it bergamot. I don't know which is right, but this is a really nice uh, Lime scented soap made by uh, Maria Armin of through the fire fine craft to the front cra Yeah, through the fire <laughs> fine craft really nice scent affordable great stuff next up we have Sterling lime which is just a straight lime Interpretation, very nice, great quality, um, not particularly expensive. It's definitely one you should have if you're a lime lover. Next up, we have Razor Rock Essential Oil of Lime. Really nice lime scent. Not tremendously uh, expensive. There's also an aftershave that goes along with this. It's quite good. I love it. Razor Rock Essential Oil of Lime. Next up, we have Alvado. I think this is called, yeah, Royal Tahitian Lime. The only thing I don't like about this, it comes in a tin and of course you know what that means there's a dent and there's a dent which stinks but I do like the scent of this it's got a nice crisp uh, lime scent I've only used it once so I need to use it more to evaluate the quality but just in terms of the scent this is a really nice uh, lime scented product and next up we have uh, Maria Armand's um, get in lime by through the fire fine craft another nice lime scented product. Uh, I also bought the aftershave to go along with this. I think the set was $24.99 for this soap and the aftershave. I really enjoyed it. It's a keeper. It worked really nice and I love this lime scent. This one is Get In Lime by Through the Fire Fine Craft. And next up we have K Shave Works Lime Light. Another nice lime scented uh, product. Excellent quality. Not too expensive. Comes from great people. K Shave Works Lime Light. Next up, we have Uncle John's Lime, and I stayed on Uncle John for probably two years to make a lime, and he made it, and it's got a really great lime scent. The scent on this one is unique. It's a different sort of lime. It is a very, very good scent. This takes a little more effort to lather because it's a harder soap, but boy, that lime scent is absolutely fantastic. Uncle John's Lime. And next up, I'm going to give you a soap that I made a mistake with. I inadvertently put this one in a box when I sent uh, some things to someone I didn't mean to. So I'm going to have to buy uh, rebuy this one. I'm going to show you a picture of it right there. So there you see it. Shannon's 25th Street Lime. Another really nice lime scent for not a lot of scratch. I really enjoy that soap. I'm going to have to rebuy it. And the last three products are creams that are a little more expensive and we'll start with St. James of London black pepper and lime and this is a really nice scent, unique. Uh, costs about 25 bucks, comes in a very nice container. Great quality stuff. St. James of London is my favorite brand of shaving cream. And next up we have True Foot and Hill West Indian Limes, another really nice cream. A little bit pricey but it is a really nice lime scent and an excellent quality cream. 
And last but not least, we have Castle Forbes Essential Oil of Lime. This is an excellent, excellent cream. The quality is absolutely off the chart, but it is expensive. It has a really nice lime scent. The only drawback on this one is it certainly is um, a bit more expensive than most, but boy, I got to tell you, this is a great uh, lime scented cream. All right, there are my top 15, or my top 15 favorite, and let's just call it favorite 15, uh, lime lemon scented uh, shaving products, soaps, and creams. Um, this video has been asked for for a long time, so there you have it. Those are my uh, favorite 15. I hope this gives you some choices if you're a fan of limes. And I would say to artisans, even though there's a lot of lime scented products, um, there's always room for another. So there are some artisans that have never made a straight lime. I'd love to see that because I'm a fan. I will definitely buy it if it's a great lime. I want to thank everybody for joining me once again. And I want to ask everyone to once again work very hard to make the entire world shape great once again.